Hey, what's going on, guys? It's me, Jake Plays, and I'm here with Lee, Bruiser. What's wrong? Uh. The electric fence came on. Some people started attacking from the woods, and we got trapped between them and the fence. Holy shit! Are, are you okay? I heard Mark yelling. Thought y'all were giving me the all clear. Man, I am real sorry. Oh my lord! What happened to you, sweetheart? It was those bastards in the woods, Mama? Yeah, I'll be all right once it's out. God damn, it hurts. Hey, y'all. Mark, oh my god, what happened? He got shot with an arrow. Christ, are you gonna be okay? Yeah, no. I'm fine. I should just pull it out. Oh no, honey, come on, Brenda's got you. Come on inside now. We'll have you all sorted out. Well, you must be the best. What kind of shit is this? We ran into some people on the way up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning, killed a bunch of our farmhand. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. You knew about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. God damn it. Carly said this place was locked down tight. Uh, so much for your so understanding. So much for your Those shitheads broke the agreement. Look, I'm sorry, Lee. If I had any inkling they were gonna give you guys trouble, well, we would have gone out there with you. Listen, we may have had an agreement with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these assholes are? They're hard to pin down, but I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. Bandits? Are you serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. What we need Stop to it. do is find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Whoa, cool your jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. I'm gonna head out and help Dan deal with these bandits. You guys should try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah, that's real charming, Dad. Where's Ben and Carly? Since Carly and Ben ate some of the food on the way to get us, she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. Hey, uh, I remember seeing kids in your group, so I went ahead and fixed that swing while you were out. I hope your kids like swings. A swing. I love swings. Just like at my tree house. Come on, Doc. Why don't you kids go and play on the swing, huh? Yeah. Thanks. Anytime. We're looking Don't look at me! Okay. Uh, not a proper intro, but hey, what's going on, guys? It's me, Jake Place, and I'm here with... It's, uh, Bruiser 04. Yeah, Bruiser 04. You can find me on YouTube as Nova Freaking Business Chicken. Wait, get... Get... <laughs> Get someone to fix that. How do you even fix that? How do I fix what? This. That. With that mess? Okay. So I'm with Bruiser here, and today we're going to play this. It's going to be awesome. Uh, we're continuing where we last started. But, uh. Oh, look at the little dog. It's too sad. It's too bad. Yeah. We played this a while ago, but we forgot. A lot. Hey, Clint. But you like the swing? Yeah, it's fun. Be sure to tell Andy thank you, okay? I will. Will you push me on it? Yeah. Sure. Happy to push you on the swing. Mind if Clementine takes a turn? All right, Duck. Let Clementine have a try for a bit. Okay. He's about to kill someone right there. Uh, how are you how doing? Are you holding up, Clementine? I'm okay, I guess. Are you okay? Yeah. Uh, I'm just a little worried about Mark. Is Mark going to be okay? Yeah, lucky out there. It'd have been a lot worse. Are you going to find the people who hurt Mark? Then yeah, we have to make sure they don't hurt anyone else. Be careful. I want you to stay lucky, too. Ever since I met you, I've had good luck, so don't worry. Okay. Uh. What do you, uh, what do you think of the dairy? What do you think of the dairy? It's pretty. It reminds me of how things used to look before. Yeah, it does. Do you think things will ever get back to how they were? 
Uh, yeah. yeah. Not sure when. One day, things have got to get back to normal. That's good. I hope it's soon. Yeah, me too. Don't I worry. wish I We're safe here now. As long as the bad people don't get me too, right? I won't let what happened to Mark happen to you. Promise? I promise. All right, Clem. That's enough for now. Okay. Thanks for pushing me. Of course. It's all yours. Yeah! Okay, Duck. Don't pop a gasket. I'm gonna talk to Ken. Hey. Hey, Lee. How's it going with the St. John's? They seem like good people. If we do this right, I still think it could work out for us here. Yeah, this place sure is a step up from that shithole motor in. Uh, true. Uh, your family made a hero. Did Duck okay? and Katja get here okay? No, well, it wasn't easy. Duck didn't look so good on the walk over to this place. Well, if everything works out, maybe he and Katja can have an easier life here. That's funny, considering you didn't seem too worried about Duck back at Herschel's farm. That's in the past, Kenny. Lots happened since then. Yeah, right. Hey, don't be a dick. I guess, uh, Lily isn't too thrilled about being here. I could give two shits about what Lily wants. Duck and Katja need food, and I'm not about to sit around that motor inn and watch him go hungry. You're with me, Otis, right? Uh, yeah, of course. Yeah, of course. Lily's judgment is clouded. But that means a pretty clear head to all Jack is him. True. How you holding up? I hope they feed us, Lee. Soon. On the way over here, I was getting dizzy. Hands shaking, cold sweats. Thought I was gonna pass out. They've got food here. Yeah, but I'm not just talking about one meal, you know? I'm gonna go have a look around. Don't wait too long to help scope out that bandit camp. Sounds like they're pretty amped up about it. This might be a good way to earn their trust. Good idea. <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna go talk to Andy and Danny. How you feeling, Lee? Look, I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. Uh, we should have told you how dangerous it was. It's no all good. Shit. You saw what they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell yeah. Who the fuck are these people in the woods? We don't know. I think some of them used to work at the big box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. Anyway, they're nutty as all hell and get mad when they're hungry. So, are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Uh, yeah, let's go. We gotta work together on this. Those bandits are a danger to everybody. Let's do it. I'll stay here and hold down the fort. Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed. Are you going now? Yeah, I'll be back soon, Clementine. Please be lucky. I will. <laughs> hey, Clementine. What Lee's got is not luck. It's all skill. This guy's... I don't know, maybe. Okay, here we go. See anything? Not yet. You know what Echo's needed both of them, right? Two different versions. I know it's no, around here. No, I turned here. the audio it's off. It's gotta be close. <laughs> No, yeah, but the audio still comes from my headphones. Here. Oh shit, you found it? Hold on. We're recording. We're recording. Stay on your guard. Stay on your guard. Watch my back, Lee. I'm gonna check out the tan. Oh. 
Better not be anyone in there. I swear to God. Yeah, true. If there is, I'm gonna pop him right in the ass. If I remember correctly. Never mind, there's no one in there. Clear. This camp's too small. It can't be their main base. Well, duh. That's what I was thinking. Take a look around anyway. There's probably some shit around here they stole from us. Yo, know, I'm gonna look in the tent. Just in case I see something, anything. That looks pretty new. Anybody inside? Two sleeping bags. One of them's kid sized. Tent looks pretty new. Anybody inside? Two sleeping bags. One of them's kid sized. <sighs> looks like they expected to be here a while. Probably. Uh, let's look in the box. Empty. Oh, what? Oh, what's in the box? Is my inner box? Is my inner box? Uh, what's in the crate? Nothing. I see something in there. What is it? I am not stupid. Some bleach. Seems to be. <laughs> just water. Well, not in there, but just some bleach. Is that bleach I see? There's <laughs> Um. Empty. But it looks like someone's been eating out of these. Recently. Lee's got some sexy eyes. And some. And that. Yeah. Never seen so. Nothing, nothing so sexy. Shit. Yeah, Brendan Yuri's. Yeah, Brendan Yuri's yeah, Brendan Yuri's a lot sexier. You and Brendan? In the boxes. All from you are not sexy. Me and the first few days they told folks to gather to the save lots by the interstate. Anything worth taking? Did, no, did, this is too much for this just one person. This is too much stuff for just one person. Trust me, these selfish bastards don't stop taking. Probably just to remind us that it's theirs. St. John Derry. <laughs> Boxes from the dairy here. Probably a food we've been giving them. Probably. Fuckers cross the line. Maybe. A remote and some bleach. Somewhere. What do you find? A camera. A video camera. Let me see that. It's a sexy video camera. Battery's dead though. Oh, good. What else they got over here? Let's see if we can find anything useful and then get a move on. I see you handled that gun I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? No, but Lily keeps us all on a regular training schedule. Lily, huh? Sounds like she's running this democracy of yours. She... she doesn't run it. Everyone in the community has a job. Like we're moving a lot of stuff. Just like in The Giver. Okay, so I had to wait for Andy or Danny to leave. I think that's Danny. No one's no one's out there. It's good to make sure. Is that a hat? I swear to god, I just saw a hat. Oh, sleeping bag. Nah, probably just Oh, I thought I just saw a hat, like near It's cons! The hell? Don't fucking do it. Oh, Shit! Bring your guns down. I ain't going back. You tell him Jolene ain't going back. Who's Jolene? Hey, we had a deal. No shooting as long as we gave you food. What the fuck happened? You had a deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are. And I know what you do. You don't know me. Steal my shit. Steal everything from me. We had a deal. You people broke it first. Who the fuck are you? <laughs> Look, it's not safe up here in the woods. You gotta come back to the dairy. <laughs> oh, it's a hell of a lot safer up here than down there, you best believe. Now, maybe you didn't hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet, put your damn guns down. You think That's I won't kill you? I'm gonna take this here crossbow and put a nice sharp arrow right through your eyeball. 
eaten into your goddamn brain. You're not men. You're monsters. All men are monsters. Take what they want and then destroy it all. Take a can of beans. Take a little girl. It's all the fucking same to you. Where did you get this hat? The little girl. You stole it from her. So what if I did? You stole her from me. What? <sighs> what the hell are you talking about? You know what? I changed my mind. I'm putting this arrow right through your balls. Yeah, right through. String them up on that tree. Then I'm gonna head down to that farm and shoot every goddamn person I see. That's enough. Y'all wave them guns like... You chose to shoot Jolene. Shit! What the hell did you do that for? We had a deal with them. <laughs> she was a... Uh, she had... She stole Clementine's hat. Somehow she got past us. Crazy fucking women must have been inches away from that child. I just couldn't take a chance on that happening again. That sound cool to you? I ain't crying about it. I mean, I know she was crazy, but damn. Hey, she had it coming. <sighs> it's a clean shot, though. Right through the forehead. That's good shooting right there. Still, what a waste. What a waste so, of what, Emma? That's it. We going back? If they ain't here, I don't know where they are. And it ain't a good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. So yeah, we head back. Once they see this, they'll get the message. Take the crossbow. It's good ammo. It's, it's extra bullets. It's extra freaking protection. Okay, I don't know whether to leave it off here or wait. I'm probably just gonna wait. Oh god, that's a lot of... Oh, is that brains? Oh, that's cool. I have a couple likes on, uh... Man, that was a hell of a ride, huh? What? You were a madman back there. Took that crazy bitch down. Good. You're back! What happened? Lee took care of it. This isn't what Terry would have wanted. Terry? My husband. Miss him every day. Oh, then screw it up for everybody then, why don't you? <sighs> oh, calm down, princess. I'll do it myself. What's going on with them? Don't know. Squabbling, looks like. A lot of tension with y'all, huh? Yeah. Uh, yeah, you could say that. Uh, they can't agree on how... Yeah, you could say that. They don't exactly see eye to eye on how we should be doing things. Well, it's probably just the hunger talking. And Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time. But you all are safe here. Don't worry. No, you can't do that. Go have Still, a look around. Cause I'll don't get wander right. too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. And thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. The barn? That woman is a lifesaver. I know, she's she's awesome. You know how sensitive my mic is? I could hear that. Turn that off. Do, do you want me to get a copyright strike? Uh, it's something bad where I get my channel taken down. Yeah, but I- this is all hard work and dedication. Then go upstairs and watch it. It's very dark in there, I don't like it. It's dark out there, why is it so dark? Maybell. It's okay, Clementine. You can pet her. It's okay. Go ahead. I 
I think she's pregnant. Whoa. Katya says Mabel could have a baby tonight. We'll see, Clementine. What's this thing? Daddy said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. Did you lick it? I don't know. <laughs> it's okay, Clem. Uh... How do you like that cow, Clem? She's pretty. Uh... How do you like that cow, Clem? She's pretty. Yeah, she's pretty, isn't she? I want to surprise her with... Here, Clementine. <laughs> My hat! You found it! Aww. I knew you'd find it. You said you would. That's Listen, so cute! Did you give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motorhead who might have taken it? No. Why? It's probably nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. Hey, Lee, do you think you'll ever have kids? I'd, uh, I haven't thought about it in a while. I don't know. I haven't thought about having kids in a long time. Well, thanks for finding my hat. You're welcome, Clem. Do you want to pet the cow with me? Nah, but you go on ahead. I'm sorry, Clem, but... Frickin' duty calls. Uh, uh... Have yeah. I missed anything? No, not really. Mm, it smells funny in here. That's a... Like duty. <laughs> Kids? Like duty. Hey, Andy. Hey there, Andy. You're yeah. Andy, okay. Uh, when do you think we um, might eat? When do you think, uh, we might eat? Hungry, huh? <laughs> Don't worry. Mama's cooking up some good grub. Yeah! We met this woman up in the woods. She seemed to know your brother. Uh, yeah, he, uh, he probably talks a little more than he ought to. How's the cow? Well, better now we got Doc on the case. Thanks. Yep. Yes. What's in these cell doors? <laughs> Thank you. Where's Ken? I need to find Ken. Use the door. Oh, let's let's see this. Whoa. You found it too, huh? Lee, they're hiding something behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff, something metal and sharp. Don't get paranoid. It's my job to be paranoid, Lee. I got my whole family on this farm right now. How about you? What about Clem? Uh, shh. You're being, uh, she's not actually fa I'll protect her. I'll protect her, her no matter what. I know you will. Look, that guy with Katya, what's his name? He locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there, Lee. What? My point is, we gotta know for sure. So go find a hammer or something, and I'll have this thing off in a second. You back me up in case them farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal on those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. All right, Professor. What'd you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. Seems to be... Four screws, and a giant, and a good lock. Actually, no, at that, eight screws. Hey, Lee, you know how to pick a lock, right? No. Why would you say that? Well, you're, you know, urban? Oh, you are not saying what I think you're saying. You're... Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Sorry. That makes sense. Some people from Florida. Hmm. What? See those screws? Instead of breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly, have a peek inside, and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. All right, sounds like you got a plan. I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow. Andy. Shit, I, th I thought that was Danny. Whatever. Can I help you boys find something? <laughs> no, nah, not really, just... Uh, 
Just checking out the barn. Just checking out the barn here. Never been to a dairy farm before. Just don't roam around without me or Danny. The farm can be a dangerous place. You know, the bandits and all. Sorry about your friend. Hey, uh, do me a favor. Don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, mama gets nervous. Andrew, I need your help again. No problem. Right away, Doc. Hey, guys, seriously, don't fuck around with that. Come on, enough already. Hey, guys, seriously, don't fuck around with that. Come on, enough already. Oops. Didn't mean to hit that. Uh, okay, Kenny. Uh, I can't, uh... I still can't get that lock off the door. Hmm. You probably just need a screwdriver or something. Any thoughts on how to distract Andy? I don't know, man. Just look for something outside of the barn. We need him out of here. Exactamenta. All right. She looks skinny. <laughs> she doesn't. Look at those fat. She's probably pregnant, which she is. Oh, I want to see that baby. It's gonna be so cute. Okay. It was dark outside. Now it's this. This is B. <laughs> so, how does a woman like yourself run this whole place? Oh, I manage just fine. Plus, I have my boys to help out. I couldn't do it without them. Kind of wanted to beat that Terry guy. So pretty cool. All right. Generator. Uh. Oh, there's a toolbox over there that we can... You know, I'm going to go talk to Lily, because uh, some... I... I want to gain her trust. I don't want to be like that guy who's, like, hates people in a series, but I want to talk to What's going on, Lee? Did something happen? <laughs> there's something odd there with the barn. There be something going on with that barn. I'm telling you, Lee. The longer we stay here, the more trouble we're getting ourselves into. And what exactly do you think I'm supposed to do about it? If you want to go in there and start rooting through other people's shit, then get to it. But if it's up to me, we should just take our food and go. Uh... What were you and Kenny arguing about when I came back from the camp? He's losing it, Lee. He comes over and starts talking about searching the barn and that these people are hiding something. The way I see it, we just need to skip the dinner and get our food to go. But I'm starting to think your friend over there has another agenda. How do you feel about leaving the motor in? I don't know. If we'd just stayed where we were, then Mark wouldn't have ended up with an arrow in his shoulder. True. It's about been three months. Your dad still treats me like I'm some kind of asshole. Yeah, well, don't expect that to change. That's just how he is. A racist? Does he treat you? No. How do you put up with him so he's the asshole? How do you put up with him? Look, my dad can be an ass sometimes, I know that. But he's not a bad guy. He just... he's got a lot of pain. He's been through so much, and lost pretty much everything. And it's hardened him, you know? Yeah, he's bitter and hateful, but that's all just to protect himself. And me. All he's got left in the world is me. And that goes both ways. So yeah, he's probably gonna keep treating you like crap, but that's just because he still has one thing left to care about. So don't judge him. Don't judge me for sticking by him. He's my dad, and I love him. After what Kenny told me, I'm starting to think they may be trying to hide something. You two are just asking for trouble. But if you insist on wandering around, I'd be careful, Lee. I'm gonna go check things out. Watch yourself, Lee. Okay. Now I'm seeing a whole different side side with Larry, but it depends because he could be a huge ass and I really don't like Larry and I don't think this is going to end well for Larry if he's still if he's still alive the rest of the season. Which I kind of hope but all right, saw and some board probably to do the a toolbox. Okay, what's what's in the, a multi-tool? 
just gonna borrow this for a second. <gasps> yeah, let's say borrow. More like stealing. Uh, let's look at the generator. Pro engine generator. Uh, let's turn it off. Oh wait, never mind. Let's wait. See, I'm smart. There, that should do it. Fucking Danny, where do you find this piece of shit? Oh, fucking thing threw a bell. Damn it, dog. Ah, oh, son of a fuck. Oh, this take forever. Hey, Danny. Or Andy, Andy, freaking son of a bitch. I gotta make it. Cause I'm smart. You don't just <coughs> excuse me. You don't just go for it. Uh right then and there. Alright, I found a multi-tool, Ken. I picked up something I think could help with the lock. Nothing to stop you now. True, and he's out of there, so. Son of a! Mom, Dad, dinner time! It's dinner time! Okay, honey, let's get that. Dad! Dad! Come on! Let's eat! Kenny, come along, honey. Kenny, come on. Don't make the children wait. I'll make an excuse for you. Get that thing off. Oh, thank God. Thanks, Ken. I don't want to do. Th yeah. All right. I'm actually gonna just keep doing the screws. Moment of truth, guys. Here we go. 